All right, I wanted to do a March recap of what happened um, in the 25,000K challenge. This is my, in my Amazon Seller Central. This is my dashboard. And as you can see, I've, I did $12,460.75 in sales, um, which was greater. I think last month I did about 10,000, just over 10,000. So a tiny bit of growth. Um, this is the biggest difference. You can see my mix down here, 465 items in the grocery category. And now this month I entered into the home appliance category selling soap molds. And I sold two, 208 of those. Now when we break these down by different SKUs, the vast majority of my revenue is still coming from this Barney Brothers butter smooth 16 ounce three pack now what's what happened in March is Amazon started and stopped selling this item uh, so it was a really frustrating month same with this item Amazon has started selling and is still selling this item so my number one and number two SKUs that were number one and two in February were still my number one and number two in March but they're definitely not going to be there in April because I'm not even selling them right now. Um, I'm out of product. Now, this one has been great. This Barney Butter Espresso Vanilla. Amazon does currently does not sell this, and it sells pretty fast. I sold 76 of them. And, when we, and then this is another one. I have quite a bit of inventory on this Barney Butter Smooth Almond Butter. My assumption is this is going to be my number one selling item for the month of April. And it, it has pretty healthy profit margins as well. Sold $703 worth of that. So here is my first soap mold. This is pretty exciting because we make quite a bit larger profit margin selling soap molds than we do um, any kind of Barney Butter product. So we sold 49 six packs. We make about four bucks every time we sell one of these. So even though the, the sales numbers are small, only 520 bucks, they still bring a fairly healthy profit. And then I still have some kind of random SKUs that I just kind of stocked up on inventory and I'm still selling through, like these organic dried apricots. This is a great example of how we used a variation. Amazon does sell organic dried apricots, the Newman's own kind, but they, they only sell a one pack. I'm selling a six pack and it's selling, you know, fairly well. Then, uh, this is another soap mold. This is a brand new one. I have 43 sales, but 40 of those were through a snag shout campaign that I did. So I didn't make any money on those, but I've ended up selling three. So we'll see how well that does in the month of April. And then, you know, more more of my soap molds, so 27 10 packs. Once again, these make a higher, you know, a very high profit margin. And then just looking at the rest, just kind of a, a mix of um, just some other Barney Butter flavors that just aren't as popular. And then I did send in some soap molds under a competitor um, listing that, that their sales rank is, is fairly high in Amazon. And, you know, those sold pretty quick. Um, this is also sold a lot of units, but this was just my snag shout campaign. And so overall, you know, a fairly healthy month at $12,460. This is the mix, though. I want to see I want to see at least 50-50 in the month of April. Um, I'm trying to sell higher, you know, items that have a, carry a higher profit margin. Um, so it would be great if this was 50-50.